Hello, my beautiful humans, and welcome to a journey of breath. We're going to be exploring extended breath work practices, going over the benefits. So let's embark on a transformative journey as we delve deep into the world of extended breath work practices. In this video, we will explore various breathwork techniques and the profound effects they can have on your mind, body, and spirit. From ancient traditions to modern science, we'll uncover the secrets behind these practices that have been used for centuries to enhance well-being, reduce stress, and cultivate inner peace. A brief overview of some different breathwork practices and techniques would be Wim Hof method, holotropic method, pranayama method, box breathing method, and more. I love Breathe with Sandy. I will link him below. He's my number one breath work practice. We'll be going over the explanation of the significance of breath work in various cultures and spiritual practices. There's a science behind breath work. There's many psychological effects of breath work on the body and the nervous system. The connection between breath, heart rate, and stress response is very significant and important. mental, emotional, and physical benefits of regular breath work practice. So try to stay as consistent as possible. There's been so many personal testimonials from individuals, including myself, who have experienced positive changes through their breath work practices. Insights into how different cultures and spiritual traditions incorporate breath work. I do want to emphasize the importance of practicing breath work safely and with awareness. Those with medical conditions should consult a doctor before doing extensive and intense breath work. There are so many personal stories and individuals who have undergone profound transformations through dedicated breath work and lead to personal growth, increased self-awareness, and spiritual insights. Below, I'll link some resources for you guys to learn more about specific breathwork techniques and guided sessions. Next, we're going to go over specific breathwork practices, some popular ones. These include box breathing, also known as four by four by four by four breathing this involves holding your exhalation for a set number of counts the name comes from the idea of boxes having four sides there's four different sets of phases of breathing wim hof method he is also known as the Iceman, dutch motivational speaker and extreme athlete He's noted for his ability to withstand low temperatures in very icy, icy conditions. His method is based on the three pillars, extended cold, relaxation, forceful breathing, followed by extended breath hold. The Wim Hof method also really helps activating the innate stress response due to the cold and the long breath holds. This forces positive adaptations. Next is pranayama. This is a practice of breath regulation. Less about those extended breath holds for me anyways and more about focusing on the consistency of my breath. In Sanskrit, uh, prana means life energy. Yama means control. This involves breathing exercises and regular patterns. It's a main component of yoga as well.
Next is a holotropic breath work. This is done typically with eyes closed, lying on a mat. You wanna use your breath and the music to enter a non-ordinary state of consciousness. Side note, very happy to be alive. <laughs> this state activates natural inner healing processes of the psyche. This helps bring the seeker a particular set of internal experiences like no other. And that's what they say about this practice. It's the most intense I've heard. If you have any recommendations on breath work that I didn't mention, please put it in the comments below. If you have any questions regarding these practices, leave it in the comments below. We'd be happy to answer them. So I'll put my shoes back on, I guess. The Wim Hof method originated in the Netherlands and it was developed, like I said, from Wim Hof himself. The method gained popularity in the 21st century due to Hof's extraordinary feats and scientific studies. This is combined with a specific breathing technique with the cold exposure and commitment to enhance overall health, increase energy levels, and reduce stress along with boosting your immune system. Wim Hof techniques involve 30 to 40 deep breaths followed by a breath retention and then a deep inhale and hold. The cold exposure definitely includes activities like cold showers, ice baths, cold plunges. The mindset and commitment behind the Wim Hof method, uh, it cultivates a strong, resilient mind through consistent practice and mental focus. That's why it's one of my favorites. Pranayama originated in India. It's the core component of traditional yoga, first mentioned in ancient Indian scriptures. It focuses on controlling the breath to enhance physical health, mental clarity, and spiritual growth. Below are the names of these techniques. One is you alternate nostril breathing to balance the nervous system. The second is you rapid, forceful exhalations to detoxify the lungs and energize the body. Last is an ocean sounding breath used during yoga postures to build internal heat and focus the mind. The holotropic breath work uh, originated in the United States. It was developed by Dr. Groff in about the 1970s as a part of transpersonal psychology, aimed at achieving altered states of consciousness for healing and self-discovery, often used in therapeutic settings. Breathing techniques are rapid, deep breathing for extended periods, typically guided by music. Participants often process their experience through art, journaling, or a group discussion after the breath work is done. Box breathing, all of the research I've looked into, it just says it was discovered in the West. While it has roots in ancient practices, box breathing has been popularized in modern times, especially among Navy SEALs and athletes. It's used to calm the mind, reduce stress and enhance focus. It is particularly effective in high stress situations. So if you're super stressed, have a super stressful job and you're on the go a lot, box breathing is the breath work for you. Um, some of the techniques involve inhaling for a count of four, holding the breath for four, exhaling for four, and holding the breath out for four. So this cycle is repeated multiple times. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to subscribe to my channel and I just want to say thank you for stopping by.